we're just excited that the world is back with us and that we get to uh, put on the players in 21. Really and truly, we, we wouldn't be here if it wasn't for the hard work of our team that's with us every day in, day out. We went from the tournament last year being canceled immediately into our preparations for this year. We looked at it like we gained three extra days in preparation for the 2021 event. Um, and we really kind of put our foot forward. Start somewhere around four o'clock in the morning, uh, getting mowers, making sure everything's set from the day before. The volunteers will come in after that. Uh, mowers will go out and all the equipment will come in. We'll go through it all again and put it back out and have it ready to go for the afternoon. I think the biggest thing is, is that we can't get comfortable when we do something good. Um, I'm, we're constantly trying to understand that there are things that we can always do a little bit better. And, you know, I'm not interested in what we've done well. I'm interested in things that we can improve upon. We've been working really hard all year long on this uh, to, to be at the best position we can be this week. We have a gold standard that we try to constantly maintain and John Deere keeping their standards at their levels is what keeps us at our levels. Long time partnership, the PGA Tour and, and John Deere, uh, Beard Equipment, our distributor here has just been phenomenal with their support. So it's not just the volunteers, it's also the vendors that we have. Uh, and John Deere just happens to be one of the best vendors that you could ever ask for for a partnership. There's a quiet, calm confidence here right now. I think we've got everything in place. We have a really good blueprint of how the week is going to go. I think every time you do one of these, it's a, it's a proud moment. Um, certainly, uh, you know, having done 26 now, um, there's always something that you, you have to be aware for and, and, and you know, have a sense of, of calm uh, so that you can pick up on the things that are going awry and kind of get them back on path. COVID presented a lot of challenges. We've had to make a lot of operational changes. The guys were very, very responsive to the new protocols that had to be put in place. So they've rolled with the punches through the ups and downs. They've stood by us and uh, we are so, so proud of our team and I uh, can't thank them enough for everything that they do for us. You're hugely proud of the team and what they've been able to accomplish. And, you know, just seeing the vision of what we need to get to.